Well, hello everyone, I'm Councilwoman Betty Guardado from District 5 in the city of Phoenix. And we're very excited and very proud to say that we hosted the first El Grito event at the city of Phoenix. As everyone knows, or may or may not know, we represent 42% of Latinos from the 1.6 million that live in the Phoenix area. We're very excited, we're very happy. We have three Latinos on the city council. This event was amazing. We saw so many people come out and be able to enjoy the tacos, the music, the arts, and just being able to enjoy each other after this awful pandemic that we just went through. And we're hoping to be able to do this every year. For those that don't know what's El Grito, it's Mexican, Mexican Independence Day. It's celebrated on the 15th. It's a day of celebration in Mexico. The president comes out, does this huge, what you call the scream, El Grito, and is able to celebrate that Mexico is independent, that Mexico is celebrating its independence. I'm a daughter of immigrants. Both of my parents are from Mexico. Councilmember Garcia was born in Mexico. Councilwoman Pastor is also a daughter of immigrants. And we're very excited to be able to host this, to be able to say you have three Latinos on the city council. So I, it's an honor for me. I'm very proud. I love my roots. I think that people need to feel proud of their roots. I think there's been so many things that have happened in the last 20 years where from SB 1070 to Joe Arpaio, where people have felt, you know, not very welcomed. And I think now we're trying to change that culture. We're trying to make people feel, you know, be proud, be Latino, be yourself, come and celebrate. Now we have Taco Tuesday. Now we have all these different things. And I think that's amazing that in the center of the city of Phoenix, the fifth largest city in the country, we're able to do this type of celebration and have people come out and we're excited to be able to do it again next year.